So someone just scammed this poor lady and her Mini Cooper. She took it into a different shop so they can check out her windows that are not working. You can see none of them are responding to anything. So they let her know that her switches are bad. As you can see, it's connected, but still no response. Here is the new switch. This is how much it cost. Car is on and still no response. So someone obviously didn't diagnose it properly and made her spend a hundred and something dollars on a switch she did not need. And on top of that, did not fix the issue. So time to actually find out what's wrong with it. So I pulled up the wiring diagram. This is for the switch. And we can see right here, driver door switch block. And we got a signal that probably controls all the other windows, a ground, which every circuit needs, and one power right here. Now, judging how it doesn't send any signal to any of the other switches, I'm guessing either this wire right here is broken or we're just not getting any power at all. So best bet is to check this fuse right here, number 69, 5M. I'm hooked into the red wire, see if it has power. No reading at all. So the fuses are actually inside the glove box, but there's no diagram. But I do remember it was one of the 5 amps. So we're gonna check all these 5 amp fuses, see which one it is. So here we are testing each one. Power, power, power. No power on that one right there. Pulled it out and sure enough, it's burnt. This is how we make sure it's bad. No contact. The new one is good, see? New one is in. We check it now and we have power. And just like that, we replaced the five cent fuse instead of charging her a whole diagnostic fee and a whole switch assembly.